Anyway, we'll we'll do this bandit camp real quick. Uh, quests, camps, do it. Pressure's lifting. Rain's here. Got one there, got one there. This one has to go like right away though. There's one. One. Ah, there they all are. I think I've got all the relevant people marked now. Sweet. Should be able to sneak up here too. Got some good news. Yeah, the rain's making it so fucking shitty. You're too fast to be Karja. What are you? Do not fear death! Beckon it! Look how many guys are left. Prove yourself worthy of a mark on my skin! Such a beauty. Prove yourself worthy of a mark on my skin. Self deprecation is not your strong soul. Get off your asses and turn. I'm not self deprecation. I'm not 
Just the hassle if it wasn't raining like a bitch. You're too fast to be Karja. What are you? That just sounds like me. You're too fast to be Karja. What are uh, you? Which is worth. That sounds to me like the perfect fucking definition of a personal problem. Helping me stay hidden, but there we go. did was talk talk bleed talk and shackle me <clears throat> like a tanakh i'd have taken you for my child you can't just take a child the strong take from the weak weak and in the taking i made stronger these stories pricked into my skin look children riches lives and land all of these have been mine. Drink of my... <coughs> my blood. And they'll live on. <gasps> no, Ilya. I've... I've got enough stories to carry. I think just teleported to a different part of the camp. I'd have to leave something else behind. Well, that's awkward. May have also killed a shitload of guys I haven't actually fought yet. Oh my. There's <laughs> only one guy left alive. Oh the cutscene literally killed the rest of the game. There's people in those cages. Savage. Well, obviously, there's at least one other thing here that's in the corpse. Oh no, there's still a thousand dudes over there. This camp is enormous. Oh, 
Traveling a bit. Look spooky outside. I've been seen. Part where they go and show the point all line up for me. Boy, last guy. I think it stops raining as soon as I finish. That was an experience there. Quietly. <laughs> Alright, so. First thing. Make a bunch of ammo. We should get our gambling box. Sell things that are only worth shards for their full price. It looks like we're good there. The Osaram have gone too far this time. Draval should die for his crimes. Go for all the loot. I don't remember right. killing most of these guys. I feel like I'm having a jackanism. Have I killed you before? You can find random corpses all the time in that game. Yeah, but it's like I distinctly don't remember putting an arrow into you. I remember that guy there. I also like how they just leave the rotting corpses on the ground while they inhabit the place. Pretty much. <laughs> Grab this one, grab one beside it, teleport back, and then get the far one, and then go hand in the quest. So, oh my god, there's another one. Jumping Jesus. Like, sometimes, there's fires literally within sight of each other, and other times they're millions of miles apart. I don't get it. What's the rhyme and reason?
also get ripped. Holy shiza! There's another fire. Now all I'm saying, there better be an achievement for getting all the fucking fires in this game. I think there is. Every time I touch a fire, like, two more pop up. I'm gonna hand this quest in. I'd probably literally spend all night just bouncing between undiscovered fires. Literally no reason not to. Yeah, like they're pretty handy. <laughs> I want to make like a little progress once in a while. Fair enough. I guess I blame you. Like there's lateral progress, and then there's actual progress. Yeah. And it's a definitive lateral move to just get telepoints. We don't deserve Yeah, but it's still very important. We kept the faith. They're the heretics, not us. I mean, let's be honest with ourselves. Your aid yeah. to the Karja Sundom in these times of strife is appreciated. That's the official response. I'd say... I can tell you've done the work by the look on your face. Two of them got themselves killed. The other... Welcome to fight to the end. They would have found death with or without you. Taken others with them. That's what I told myself. Smart girl. Doubt will meet again, so Baron Von go in light. Arrested two for disorderly conduct last night. You don't want to know what they were doing. Let the experience load out. Dick. Birds. My uncle passed away in the night, but just yesterday. I got two points. You know what, I'm actually going to spend them on Balanced Aim, because even in that side quest, there's so many times I wanted to shoot well on uh, a rope and I couldn't. Right. Looks like here be the edge of the map. That tall neck's probably pretty useful. Here'd be rape, boys. Alright, so we've actually uncovered almost the entire map. Look at all the fucking fires. Jesus. Here, here'd be cock. I somehow missed one back here. I touched all these green fires, guys. Look at all of them. You're a dick, you're a dick. But there's only a few places we haven't been. Okay, got some time. 
I think I'm going to get this tall neck. Let's go, let's go to here first. Actually, is a way we can have a permanent mount. Because, like, when you hack them, sometimes they just disconnect when you do certain events. Yeah, it's unfortunate, but... Is there an ability you get there that will always call like a hacked strider or a hacked um, longhorn? Um, mount repair, machine repair, mount repair, call mount. Yeah, so I need eight points. It's in the combat override tree. <laughs> So that's like exactly the, one of the first ones I got. Yeah, so it is unlimited mounts, but <clears throat> it's it's not in a tree that I like. I, I rarely override is the thing. Pretty damn useful. I know, but like they I hate how they just stop whatever they're doing. It's like why don't we just stand up and each other? You should have waited until they're close. You should now. I like how those machines like fire bell back and these are clearly not fire bell back. Shoot one of them! I'm just gonna piss off. Why, Andy? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually test something. You're too close to the destination. Once it turns green, can I teleport to it? Even if I haven't That's actually it. saved at it. Here. You can. So even without lighting it, it still becomes a telepoint. But I like to light them anyway. Uh, this is also Cauldron Z. Um, let's, let's do the cauldron. No reason not to. This one's infested with bandits. Cultus. Fancy name. Excuse me for trying to use specific and informative basil. The only cultists that matter are the crimson ones. You can't prove me wrong there. 
Don't the cults usually have pet machines? Um, yeah, not these ones. Uh, Fuck that guy in particular. Why did we shoot a human with one of these roots? I wonder. I don't think they're affected that much. Be interesting to know though. To start. Super fuck that guy. Excavation key. That seems important. Getting lots of keys. This will be important. Well, they're actually in the cauldron, probably. So it's probably the key to get into the cauldron. Like, it's so important that you even put one here if you're trying to stealth it without killing anyone. You know what? If the game gave you experience for stealthing an area, I'd be more inclined to do it. That's the way I thought about it. Like, in Skyrim, for example, if you sneak, you get more sneak skill. So, you like, you're still leveling up. Since the way you level up is by upgrading your skills. But, like, here... I actually lose experience by sneaking. Can't carry more. Also, I'm definitely taking this with me as long as the game will let me have it. Probably won't be long if you're going to into a cauldron. It's full of humans. Hmm. God, you can at least let them talk the deepest lore. <laughs> you know, I'm usually all for the deepest lore, this but... A once. <laughs> I really the liked <laughs> when they turn the around and go, fuck. I like how I shot the first guy with a very loud weapon, and the second guy is like, hey, what was that noise? Didn't even have a red fucking alert. Shots, bro. I'll just tap the trigger. Like, it's more than enough to rip a boss. As long as you can hit their vital spot, yeah. Like, different vital spots have a different degree of multiplier to them. Yeah, I think with this weapon, for a level 18 cauldron, I could just, like, spray and, and still do pretty well. Maybe. I think they're gonna make me swim, though. Got too much already. Oh, nope. I can avoid swimming. 
down. For now. There's like a dead tall neck in here. What the fuck does that have been a cave in. A big I don't know, but look at it. It's a tall neck graveyard. There's more than one. Ah. Thank you, Aloy. You were helpful. If this place used to give birth to machines, why does it feel like such a tomb? You're getting grim, you know. You need more sun. I hit pull on every one of those. Uh, I'm gonna run out, but it basically did the whole level for me. So roly poly. <laughs> Look how this guy over here is like, hey guys, where'd y'all go? I need to figure out why the cult is here. This place is pretty verdant for being so closed off. Well, God knows when this place is breached. I'll tuck that away. Yeah, to be fair, what breached it? Yeah. And because this is a cultist camp, there's so much freaking loot everywhere. Oh yeah, cultist camp's better. There's even a fucking supply crate all the way up there. <coughs> I don't know how to get there. Presently, but... I mean, the other reason we're not seeing more long necks is only a finite amount because this is the call that made them. Probably. Okay, so there's some loots that I won't be able to get because I don't know how to get to them. Oh, it's purple though. It's a purple supply crate. Kind of important that I get that. Okay, so there's a rope there. Jump on here, jump on here, jump on here. <laughs> there's lots of herbs up here too. 25% spear damage coil. Uh, modify. Don't 
does on the armor, dude. Mm. Well, armor's already full, unfortunately. I guess not. But my spear is not here. I don't know. I feel like why you have that weapon equipped, do you get bonus damage? And I'm pretty sure I put a mod in my spear already, I just can't remember how I did it apparently. We have it, so it doesn't matter. We can, we can always figure it out later. It's just having the mod that's the uh, important part. So have you still got all the power cells for the real armor? No, I'll need to look shit up. This place is pretty deep. Because I'll have to do a lot of backtracking. Really? Yeah. So I think the one, uh... The one that they just hand you is supposed to be the last one you get. It's usually in the boss room. There's ads, but I'm not seeing them yet. Are easy. Oh my god, could you just complete the circle so I could mark them? Jesus. Yeah, humans are so non threatening. Spotted. Like, there goes their heavy. Now what, Brad? <laughs> Fire bombs. That's what happens when you throw fire bombs. I said, if you missed one more shot on that last guy, I was about to be fairly disappointed in you. See, the ones w where the fire was blocking the view was a little bit reasonable, but the other misses weren't really. I do the core because um, overriding core is the elevator back to the top. Yeah, 
they actually put an invisible wall here. Whoa. But, like, <laughs> the passage ends just like a few feet further. What's, the, what's even the point? Maybe there's a glitch there. They couldn't figure out how to patch so it was a retroactive ad. Or maybe the glitch is that uh, the door didn't appear. Render. I can buy that. It's, it's a fairly common glitch. <coughs> Happens in Warframe all the time. Yeah. The door won't open. The door won't close. Let's see what they're so afraid of. Machines I can override. What have you done? Kill the savage, cut her down. Guy for a reload. Show them the power of the shadow. Look out! She's a waste machine. No, you're just wasting my energy. Let me start. Oh, you blew it up, you damn dirty ape. Oh, here come the machines. Pray and pray. Let's find an exit, but look at all this loot. Oh, grab all the fucking loot. Man, it's a fucking massacre in here. Jeez, it's like. Forget about traveling Mr. light. Mr. Cleanup detail. Got like an armory of deathbringers down here. Pretty much. Man, I wish I could take these with me. It's like um, bolt two is into the side of a strider. Settlement eggs. Okay, uh, apparently my mods are full.
do the crappy ones. Getting in my eyes. Whoa. Get out of my way. <laughs> Just move that thing up. Should have brought a cart. I just examine, get out of here. Actual cum dumpster. <laughs> Too many things on the dance floor. I may end up actually going so I can get to bed by 12 when I get enough sleep. I gotta be up early tomorrow. Indeed. Like, I. I'll probably end shortly after I loot the crap out of this because there won't be enough time to do anything else. Look at how deep the destruction goes. Oh, I picked the perfect time then. I guess we will catch you all tomorrow with Final Fantasy. Um, we finished Final Fantasy VII actually, so it'll oh, be yeah, something we did, new. Didn't we? Yeah. Oh yeah. It involves serial numbers. So thank you all for watching. We'll catch, or I will catch you tomorrow, but we'll keep playing. Good night, everybody. Yeah, we're only gonna play for ten more minutes, though, so uh, don't worry about it. Yeah. Night. Bye. Right about that corpse. You slime. You absolute slime. Pop everything up just because we can. Who cares if we waste some materials? First time in full on ammo in a long time. Looks like I can't pull anything cheeky. I'll probably just have to actually walk out. They give you so many heavy weapons in that last room. It's not really that big of a deal.
They get stunned for so many times. Hopefully it doesn't summon another one for each one of those that goes off. That's probably the way out, so... Explore some more of this room. Looks like there's no loot. There's the core still ticking away. So I guess that is indeed that. That is hence. You know what? It's a bit of a different cauldron. I can appreciate that. like there's a stalker here too. surprised if there was another one. This room... This is... I'm a little bit dubious about there being three, but... There's three. I might be making them, like as I'm killing them. No space. Like in fairness, could be constructed in real time. what an ancient rope looks like now. 
almost out of here. Only from the battlefield over here. Just I'm helping you right now. I need to fart right off. I'm taking shots on both sides. These guys are slippery as eels. This is probably my favorite cauldron so far though, just for the loot. And the loot crates refresh. Full already. There's, there's loot over there, though. So you know where I'm going. Country roads, mate. Country roads. <laughs> Like West Virginia up in there. Any more surprises? About to get loud. You seem like a pretty fun guy. I love how the rope doesn't actually have to physically pass through anything. Like, I shot it there, and then I went around the other side and shot it just passed through, didn't care. I'd have to ditch something. Well, they thought they were going down there. Well, so much for a salvage operation. They meddled with something they couldn't control. Let me do with me. What a fucking mess. We 
did level up, but uh look at this mess guy. I don't think they could hit me from that angle if they wanted to. We went through a lot of ammo on the way out. Holy god. We actually went overtime. I thought it would just be uh, easy and easy out. I'm gonna get my gun back though. A sloppy, sloppy cauldron at the end. We're almost done, though. I'd have to leave something else behind. Um, let us get combat override, so we can start getting the uh, infinite horses perk. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, slam down on the follow button on Twitch or the like button on YouTube. And uh, if you are watching on YouTube, hit subscribe, helps it a lot. And we'll catch you next time. Bye now.